Mel Gambrell here with App Geek for Hire. I'm using a new screen sharing program for the mobile device. So if I get any phone calls or any notifications, I'll try to just dismiss them. But please forgive me in advance. In this video, I want to talk about why using a loyalty reward program is an absolute 100% must for you to incorporate in your business. Now, I'm going to really quick take a look at this report done by Marketing Land. Uh, you can just Google it online if you like. And it's titled The Eight Reasons Why Loyalty Programs Are Imperative for Marketers. Having a rewards program is imperative for anyone trying to offer any kind of goods and services. It doesn't matter if you're doing Mary Kay, if you're a network marketer, insurance agent, personal trainer, small mom and pop restaurant, whatever it is, whatever goods and services or that you offer, it is imperative that you have some kind of loyalty rewards program. All the Fortune 1000 companies are already on the bandwagon. So why come you are not? It has been proven loyalty reward programs. It's, it's, it's a done deal. It is proven to boost your growth. So if you're trying to grow your business, why don't you have a loyalty rewards program yet? The loyalty rewards programs are not expensive. Uh, the ones that I create for small business owners and independent contractors, I make them extremely, extremely affordable for you to be able to use. Oftentimes for merely the cost of what you would spend on purchasing business cards on a monthly basis. Loyalty rewards programs are going to boost your reputation. I love bragging about the fact that I'm a gold mem member with Starbucks. And I always reference Starbucks in pretty much just about every conversation that I have when I'm talking about business to someone with someone. It's going to increase your sales by including enticing awards. Uh, one of the things I like about Starbucks, which I'm going to show you in a second, is that, you know what? My money is hard to come by, right? So when if I'm spending money with you, I appreciate the fact that you are willing to give something back to me if I show you a little bit of loyalty. So that is one of the main things that I take away from a loyalty rewards program is that I really do appreciate the fact that you're doing business with me and I want to reward you for it. And I appreciate the fact that a company is going to reward me for doing business with them, especially if I'm spending my hard earned money with them and it's going to cost me nothing extra to be a part of the loyalty rewards program anyways. Right. So the other thing is it provides vital market research. Uh, you can have numerous different rewards programs so you can determine which program works the best, which product sells the best, which service that you have sells the best. Now I'm going to uh, Speedway does a really good job of that. And I'm going to highlight that in just a few uh, few moments. It makes your customers happy. It makes me happy. I know that uh, probably by today is Thursday. Probably by Sunday, I'll be in line for another free drink at Starbucks. And just yesterday, I had a free drink at Speedways. So, you know, it does make your customers happy. Uh, it makes your, cu your customers brag about you. People like to brag about what they got that was of value and that was for free. So you want to employ that in your business because it's definitely going to help your business grow. You can provide in-store or digital rewards, or you can do both. Uh, so with my mobile app, you can do whichever one that you'd like. Uh, once it gets started, it's, it's, there's no work. All you got to do is just implement it, and it goes from there. And with my mobile app, you can send people push notifications to highlight different rewards programs or different promotions that you're coming up with. And now, why is it time for you to set up a lawyer to reward program? Because all of your competitors are doing it. <laughs> That's one of the biggest things is that all your competitors are doing it. And if you really are in the business acquisition, if you really are trying to grow your business, why not start rewarding your customers now? Why are you prolonging not rewarding your customers? The sooner you do, the faster your business will grow. So those are just a couple of things that I just want to highlight in that report. This is actually my Starbucks rewards program. I actually have 84 stars. So 
by in a couple of days, I will be able to get another free drink. I average a free drink with Starbucks at least once per week. That's how often I go. You see that I have go status through November 21st, 2019. It, Starbucks app used to list uh, <clears throat> that, you know, you'd have go status for like a couple years. Now, I would brag about that. It's like, well, you know, I'm a Gold Star member through the next two years. But if you look at my account, I don't need to purchase anything else, and I'm still going to be a Go Status member through November 20, uh, 2019. So if you uh, take a look at that. So with the uh, <clears throat> Speedways app, you know, along with my mobile app, it's really good to be able to offer multiple rewards programs. And as you can see with Speedways, so right now I have about a 10,000 points with speedways you've earned 11,067 points uh, over the last year so it, it gives you it, tra it lets you know how many points that you know that you have and they have award they have rewards programs for different things so if you buy mountain dew all the time then you're going to get rewarded with the mountain dew if you buy cokes all the time then you're going to get rewarded with the uh, cokes if you buy the uh, fountain drinks then you're going to get rewarded with the fountain drink so and it tells you how many points that you need for each of the items that you might want to get i buy frito lays so therefore i get free doritos or free uh cheetos <laughs> every now and then so so I like their app because of the fact that you can add, they have many different rewards programs that you can sign up with. And it's one of the few companies that I know that has a dozen or more rewards programs that you can sign up for. And that's sort of what I suggest that you do with your mobile app as well, is to create as many rewards programs as you want. As you see in this list, this is like a tab of a lawyer to rewards program. This whole page can be filled up with 30 or 40, 50 different loyalty rewards programs. So this is right inside of the mobile app. This is actually my mobile app, and this is that's one I use for illustrative purposes. So let me click on it. And so there's two different styles of loyalty rewards programs that I like with this one. One, you can do the traditional, you know, such as if you offer a monthly recurring program for your business, make five payments on time and get the six payment for free buy five personal training sessions get the six one for free refer so many people get a 250 dollars shopping i mean you can make the rewards program whatever you want you can increase it from them having to purchase purchase five items up to 24 items so if it's something really if you're giving away something really big you might say hey on your 25th purchase you're going to get a thousand dollar shopping spree whatever the case might be um but if you go to stamp it then it says please hand your device to the business representative who will stamp your card so i'm not going to put mine in because it's going to show you what my code is the other thing I like is the refer a friend program. Um, so, for example, with this particular refer a friend program, each you can this one's set up by points. So the other one is just basically a stamp. So you purchase something and you get a stamp. But this one right here, you build up points and you build up to 300 points. So each stamp you get is worth 25 points. So each time you refer a friend, you got to refer 12 under this example and you can make it however you want you're going to get 25 points now the cool thing i like about this is that you can see if you see those three little tabs at the bottom you can see it's like one referral credit let me click on it so it gives you multiple ways in how you can build up points for your customer or how the customer can build up points for in this sample if they can get two points each time they pay on time two points and you paid on time for 12 times then you get a full 25 point stamp so that's just something automatically you can give the customers to help reward them for paying on time right so that's a pretty cool little feature you can do uh people can get you can give someone 25 points for writing you a review so there's five major reviews so the way this is set up is if they write five awesome reviews on the top five review sites, you're going to give them one stamp, which is worth 25 points. The other one that I really love, pay attention to this one, because this is definitely a moneymaker for your business. So the, the last one 
that gives customers an extra opportunity to gain credits is that earn 25 points when you pay for a promoted post on Facebook. Now, Facebook is king with traffic, even despite all the controversy right now. Facebook is still an awesome source to get the word out about your business. So you can monetize that. A promoted post with Facebook costs $10. So basically, you post something on Facebook, and you've probably seen it, and then po- Facebook will say, hey, reach more people, do a promoted post, and it costs $10. And then Facebook is going to blast it out to way more people for them to be able to see. Well, with this, you can reward your customers for doing a promoted post about your business. So give them 25 points, give them 50 points when they do three promoted posts, which is $30, right? So now, imagine if you have 100 customers and all 100 customers do a promoted post for you. That's $3,000 in Facebook advertisement that you did not pay for. If you have 100 customers and all of them do a promoted post for you, that's $3,000 in advertisement on Facebook that you did, excuse me, you did not pay for. Now, why would a customer spend purchase three promoted posts on Facebook? So let's just say that you're giving away a $500 shopping spree. So you got to make your rewards enticing enough, right? So let's just say that you are giving away $500 shopping spree. And if and that your customer has 10 stamps, they need 12. And you entice them, I tell you what, you do, you're two stamps away from being able to get a $500 shopping spree. Why don't you do three promoted posts for me? And if you look in the app, you'll see that you'll get 50 points. And that will give you your $500 shopping spree. Who in their right mind is not going to turn right around to Facebook and do three promoted posts for you, which cost them a grand total of $30 so that they can immediately receive a $500 shopping spree. <laughs> that is just, it is totally genius. And if you're not doing that with your business, you need to start doing that now. So that is one of the things that I like with this particular format is that you can entice your customers and you can get creative with the rewards program that you're offering people. So again, my name is Mel Gambrell with App Geek for Hire. And if you are not doing promoted posts on Facebook, if your clients are not doing that for you, give them a reason to do it. It will explode your business. Loyalty Rewards Program is one of the number one reasons as to why you want to use a mobile app as opposed to using a website. And it's the number one reason why you want to use a mobile app in the first place because it will greatly explode your business. If you have any questions whatsoever, feel free to reach out to me again. Mel Gambrell with App Geek for Hire.